G'day guys, welcome along to the uh, little video. Um, this is my channel, A Kiwi Life, so uh, welcome along. Hope you enjoy the video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and um, all that sort of stuff. So uh, today we're going to be talking about water purification and especially the mini soya. So um, what we're going to start with is these drops. So I've been using these drops mostly um, for years. You know, I've probably been going bush for... Oh, 20 something years now so at least and so um well even since i was a kid really going to scouts and stuff but i'm really on my own in, in deep bush and needing these kinds of products you see so um what we're going to start with is the pour and go it's just a basically a purification drops but they are a chemical but the good thing about these as well is you can use them as a disinfectant you can use them as um as your water filter and um washing your dishes and stuff like that to just debug things but um as you say it is a chemical and if you if you want to put something in that you're not going to chemicalize um that's probably your, your best bet you see with this stuff you're going to be putting this in dirty water and it's not going to change the fact that it's dirty it's just going to kill the bugs in there so you'll still be drinking dirty water you'll just be using clean dirty water because it won't have any bugs in it so these are pour and go drops. I got these, I think, might have 10 maybe years ago. Um, but I used to use uh, little tablets, um, little pills that you just drop in, um, all sorts of different ones. Um, basically, essentially, these products are just uh, bleaches and they just bleach and they just kill the stuff in the water. So that's that side of things. Then we can move on to something like this, the Soya Mini, which is awesome. You can also get stuff called the Steripens, which is a UV light, and you stir it in the water. The same thing appeals applies to that. You're not really filtering the water with that. You're just killing the bugs in it. Is the same as the drops. Um, there also is the soya squeeze, I think, which is a bit bigger version. This is just the mini. This is perfect. The good thing about this is it filters 100,000 gallons, which equals up to be about 380,000 liters of um, water. So this is mean. You can share it with your mates. You know, you only need to take one of these out with you. It's going to do you for years, even if you're sharing it. And they're about $59 New Zealand. I think they might be about 20 something, five bucks US. Um, anyway, so great product. Probably the best product on the market, which I've seen is uh, most uh, people rate these very highly up pretty much at the top. I've seen people desalinate water, which is warm and brown and horrible. And it comes out pretty much looking like water again. And um, with a little bit of colour, but this water was bad, so that's why um, I've stepped me up and I'm going to go with one of these. So um, you can also get something called a life straw, that is awesome too, which is about 30 bucks. Um, I think they do about 100,000 gallons, no, 1,000 gallons, which is about 4,000 litres. So you might as well pay the extra 20 bucks and get you one of these. This is going to get you 100, 200,000 more litres than the other one. So we're just going to open this baby up. Grab my opal knife. Don't want to wreck the, the package too much. So um, here we go. I'm heading off on a trip into the South Island soon, and I don't um, know where I'm going to be staying, so we need something like this. But basically in New Zealand, most of the times, I've actually never really needed products to do it. The water in New Zealand is pretty good where I've gone. And um, apart from um, in the Waitakere Ranges the other week when I went up the probably wouldn't want to drink out of that so um yeah great things with these soya minis as well is you've got all these little options so um not only can you do that you can get a coke bottle fill your coke bottle up with your water squeeze on your filter boom then you've got a straw here you can whack that straw onto there suck it you've got water there got a massive um thing so not only that is awesome that you can use that you don't actually have to use the pouch that it came with this pouch is i think 500 mils i'm going to go with uh, 16 ounces which is i'd say 500 mils probably about so um yes and what you want to do is um you also get a syringe with this this is to backwash it after you've used it so you want to push all your gunk opposite way out of the filter so um that fits on there i think 
I actually really haven't read up on this. This is just a product video. So, um, yeah, saw your mini. There, there we go. So, as we go, another cool thing about why I got this is everyone, um, cannibal packs, day tramps. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, camel packs, day tramps, and all that kind of stuff. A lot of people like camel packs. One of the cool thing is, get one of these filters, you can cut a line in there and you can put it in between your line, fill up wherever you want, you're always gonna have filtered water coming through. 50 bucks, you might as well buy one for one of these, keep it on there. Great, great thing. Um, so basically, all, we, all we're gonna come with here is we're gonna come with those instructions that I just um, had and lost. Just gives you a few helpful hints and stuff like that. Uh, do not squeeze the pouch too hard. Backwash the filter more often and with more force, bringing the lightweight cleaning plunger or cleaning coupling on your trip. Well, if it's a multi-day trip, you probably might want to bring this. If you're just going to go for a day or so, I probably wouldn't even bother using that. I'd just do it when you came home. So this is the Sawyer Squeeze Mini, guys. Great little thing. So all you're going to have is these three little pieces. I'll be inclined to roll it up like that. It's a shame it doesn't come with a little pouch. That would be really cool if we could get a little pouch with it and um, stick it away, but unfortunately we don't get a little pouch with that, so I'm gonna have to find some sort of a small pouch and um, that which I can stick my water filter system in, and that's gonna be awesome. So um, now when I head off in the hills, I don't need to worry about my drops, because occasionally I forget these, but this um, this will just stay in my pack, because I used to use these for my bus as well. I used to put it in the water as well, so I used to chop and change, so sometimes I'd leave it in the bus. I'd head out somewhere and I'd, shit, I forgot my water stuff. But uh, this will stay in my pack. And um, away we go. This will probably stay in my little, um, my little safety container, I think, with all my little knives and compasses and stuff like that. Okay, guys, we're just going to test the Sawyer Mini here. Let's give it a little test and see how it goes. I just want to see if it's going to filter out the... Um, chlorine that we have in our water here so hopefully it'll be all good to go so it's gonna tip this is gonna be the filthy water chlorinated filthy water I'm gonna tip that in there there we go fill that up nicely um, and one thing is you probably want to blow on that before you start I've been told because it blows the, uh, the sack up a bit or the pouch should I say so here we go Boom, put that back. Here we go. Oh, we'll give it the test, see if she's purified. Pretty good guys, pretty good. Yeah, that's good. Lots more videos to come. Kate, take it easy. Kakite. Haru.